Always got to take this out because these chemicals are not supposed to be eaten by humans. They're very toxic poison to us, but I just added some real bacon bits. Then I had added my two cans of kidney beans and pork and beans. Adding that flavor in there. I'm going to add some great northern beans. We're going to get ourselves some really good, good chili. Now, I learned this in Texas and honestly, it's going to be really good for everyone to be trying y'all. Sorry, I'm looking for my measuring cup. I have one cup. One cup is going to be the day, um, the measuring cup that we're going to need to remember. I got one cup, so I got one cup of chicken or beef broth. Oops, I'm gonna put that in there. All right, I got one cup of ketchup we're gonna put in here. really squeeze hard y'all <laughs> lord mm -hmm. all right so we're gonna put all of that ketchup in there i have some white vinegar we are going to do three tablespoons two three i just love when i put vinegar it really pops out the other flavors now vinegar by itself isn't good but vinegar does heighten i believe um other flavors so here i got my um kidney beans again beans after beans y'all this is what you get when it comes to and some black beans that's the only black beans that i had mmm Y'all, yeah, this is gonna be good. And then I got some mustard, some yellow mustard. I got all my ingredients today from Albertsons. One. And you want two tablespoons. Ooh, yeah. That noise is all too familiar, y'all. We gotta go through it. All right, so I'm going to get my mixer. Just really mix everything together gotta get the, it going just like that you guys I'm gonna put this over here because I'm going to use it again I added some bacon now we're gonna add some beef so I'm gonna go ahead and open this I got the 80 um, 20 80 percent lean and 20 percent fat they have other ones but they're more expensive they have what like 90 10 and 85 15 stuff like that um i'm going to go ahead and just bring this out and kind of just plop it yeah i should have thought about that um but yeah okay so i'm gonna just place it down it's gonna really cook just like that And then I do have some vegetables. I want to add some vegetables to this, you guys. So here I have my washed. Green bell pepper. Now, sometimes I don't understand why some of them have seeds. Some of them don't have seeds. Never um, have understood that. Uh, I don't know if it's like GMOs. You believe in GMOs, Ryan? What's that? Genetically modified. I mean, that's like stuff in food. Well, you know, kinda, but like, it's kind of what we do to food. You know, we just make it better. Yeah. I don't know. And we but so is it better? Uh, I don't know. I'm not that's the question. <laughs> <laughs> that's the question. All right, so I'm gonna just go ahead and blot these bell peppers in there just for some added flavor I have one more thing that I've got to add which is some light brown sugar so we're gonna put a whole cup which is the rest of this bag of light brown sugar in this chili 
Again, I learned this in Texas. Now you could go ahead and add some hot links if you want it. There's so many things that you can add um, to just intensify um, the flavor. But I like it just like this. That, that meat um, is gonna cook real well when everything gets hot and this is going to be super delicious i can't wait to show you guys and we will be back in about four and a half hours because that's how long it's got to cook and i can't wait to show you guys all right bye right you guys here it is this chili looks and smells delosh oof dang this smells bomb Look at all of that. Those kidney beans, black beans. The ground turkey is really cooked and ripe. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And I'm so happy because I'm touching the bottom and I ain't gonna have to scrub. <laughs> all right, so let me go ahead and get these. This is an all natural home recipe for your dogs. No, I'm joking, y'all. This is what I'm gonna eat. It's hot. Really hot. Okay. Those really, those pork and beans really came through. Made that like, um,. My neighbor says, she said, oh yeah, that's gonna have like a sweet hickory taste. And then that bacon, I, the bacon is so good. Mm-hmm. That's a hit. Go ahead and make this for you and your family. Put this over some rice, some mashed um, potatoes, however you like.